Do you feel it, Boo? The path of virtue beneath my boots once more! Boo and I, we are in your debt, my friend. As you wish, but quietly, it is listening. No! There is a very ancient and very wise saying that Minsk lives by. He who would try to control evil must beware lest evil tricks him, steals his clothes, and kicks his backside with his own boots. I read it on the privy wall in the Blushing Mermaid many years ago. Oh, Minsk knows all about this Emperor. It has tried to introduce itself to me already. Minsk does not trust it. No, I do not think our new friend wishes to see me blubbering, Boo. Minsk is normally the strong and violent type, but... If you insist on hearing a sad tale, he can tell it. This Emperor played a very cruel trick. It made me believe that something lost had been found. It came to me in dreams, wearing a face I never thought to see again. Dinah here. A witch of my homeland. She was to be the greatest of them, and I her protector. It was not easy. She was a fierce and independent cub. She did not think she needed Mother Bear Minsk to protect her. And she was right. The Elder sent us out into the world, thinking it would teach her to bow a little. But it was the world that bowed to Dinah here, wherever she went. And Minsk blundered along behind. And in the end, it was she who died, protecting me. No, my friend. It is not the past I saw, but Dinah here as she would have been. Should have been. Hearing her voice again, for a moment Minsk almost believed it. But then... The Emperor made a mistake. He did the one thing that Tiny here would never, ever do. It told Minsk exactly what he wanted to hear. Dinah here. Hers was more the habit of teaching Minsk many new ways to say the word fool. Ah, I think on what she would say to Minsk now, cowering from a creature in his own skull. Fine! If you say this tadpole is a weapon, then let us wield it. So long as it is still our hearts that guide us, yes? <laughs> 